Ever wondered how databases ensure data integrity, especially during complex transactions? ACID properties are the foundation for data trust in your database system, ensuring your data is accurate and reliable. Let's explore what they are and how they work. ACID stands for Atomicity, Consistency, Isolation and Durability. Let's delve into each property. Atomicity. This is the all or nothing rule. Imagine building a Lego house. With atomicity, either the entire house gets built or none of it does. Similarly, a transaction is treated as a single unit, which is unbreakable like an atom. A transaction can include one or more steps or changes. Atomicity ensures that all changes succeed or the database rolls back everything if something fails midway. This prevents any partial updates that could compromise the integrity of your data. Let's take a transaction example. Imagine transferring $100 from account A to B. This involves checking A's balance, debiting A, and crediting B. Atomicity ensures the entire transfer succeeds by completing all the steps or fails. If something goes wrong due to insufficient funds or a system crash, the transaction returns, leaving both accounts unchanged. Thus, it prevents inconsistencies like missing debits or phantom credits. Next one, consistency. It's like maintaining the rule book. It ensures that your data adheres to predefined rules, maintaining its accuracy and integrity. Imagine your database has rules like account balance cannot be negative or product ID must be unique. Consistency ensures that after any transaction like adding, updating, deleting the data, the database still adheres to these defined rules. Enforcing consistency prevents invalid or corrupt data from entering the system. This safeguards the accuracy and reliability of your data, which is crucial for applications that rely on trustworthy information. Moving to the next one, isolation. This ensures no interference allowed or no concurrent chaos. Let's talk about this. Multiple users can access a database concurrently. We know that. Isolation ensures these transactions appear to happen one at a time, even if they are happening simultaneously. This prevents issues like dirty reads, non-repeatable reads, or phantom reads. What are these? Dirty reads means seeing uncommitted data. Let me explain. Imagine you are a bank teller processing a wire transfer. You check the system to see if account A has sufficient funds for a $1,000 transfer. However, before you can confirm the transaction, the account owner calls and initiates a withdrawal of $500. That means two transactions are happening concurrently. Due to a dirty read, you might accidentally approve the transfer for $1,000 even though the account balance wouldn't support it after the withdrawal. This could lead to an overdraft and a negative balance for the account holder. Non-repeatable reads. This means reading the same data twice and getting different results due to concurrent modifications. You are a financial analyst reviewing a client's investment portfolio. You check the account balance and see $50,000. This is one transaction. While you are analyzing the details, the client sells some stock holdings, reducing the balance by $10,000. This is a modification by another transaction. If you recheck the total balance without proper isolation, you might end up seeing $50,000 again instead of $40,000. This leads to inaccurate analysis 
and potentially misleading investment advice. Another inconsistency is phantom read. This is nothing but seeing newly added data during a transaction. Say you are a loan officer reviewing loan applications. You search the system for applicants with a credit score exceeding 720. That means you are reading the data in one transaction. While you are reviewing potential borrowers, a new application comes in and gets approved, adding someone with a high credit score to the system due to new data insertion by another concurrent transaction. Due to phantom read, you might end up seeing this new applicant listed in your search results even though they were not there initially. So this is potentially causing you to miss out on reviewing other qualified applicants who applied earlier. By understanding isolation, you ensure reliable data in concurrent scenarios. Last but not least, durability. This is weathering the storm. Let me explain. Imagine writing a grocery list on a whiteboard and taking a picture for backup. Durability guarantees that changes you make to the database persist even in case of system crashes or power outages. The DBMS uses techniques like write-ahead logging, which acts like a picture ensuring changes are written to a log and then applied to the actual data storage so a crash wouldn't affect your data. So that is about durability. Now let's understand how ACID works behind the scenes. Database management systems employ various techniques to implement ACID properties. One of them is locking mechanisms. Data can be locked during a transaction to prevent interference from other transactions, ensuring data consistency. Next one, journaling. DBMS often maintain transaction logs and track all changes made within a transaction. This log is crucial for rolling back failed transactions or replaying changes during recovery. Another technique is write-ahead logging. This technique ensures changes are first written to a log and only then applied to the actual data storage. Even if a crash occurs, the log can be used to recover the data. But there is a catch. Balancing consistency versus performance. While ACID is ideal, it can impact performance for enormous data sets. In such cases, some systems use BASE, which is opposite to ACID, right? BASE stands for basically available, soft state, eventually consistent as an alternative. BASE prioritizes availability over strict consistency, which can be helpful in large-scale applications where immediate consistency is not critical. Understanding ACID is crucial for anyone working with databases, especially when dealing with sensitive information like financial transactions or medical records. Thanks for joining me today. The world of databases is vast and different models offer varying levels of ACID guarantees. If you are curious to learn more, leave a comment below and let me know what interests you. Subscribe to the channel for more tech adventures and hit that notification bell so you never miss an upload. See you in the next one.